it's not going to take up that much time. Maya, this is your last semester of high school. I just don't want you getting distracted and letting your grades drop. Mom, I won't. Haven't you heard the term second semester senior? Yes, but it's not always that easy. Ugh, I'll be fine. I just don't want you falling behind because of some dance. Mom, it's prom, not just some dance. I've dreamed about prom for years. Well, just in case you don't remember, prom doesn't carry the fondest memories for this family. I'm not going to get hooked on cocaine if that's what you're saying. Don't do this right now. <laughs> oh, come on. Just because I have a self-destructive older sister means I don't get to have fun? Sorry. I'm just concerned, okay? I promise you, this won't affect my grades or my life. I'm not interested in drugs, okay? I promise. All right, you can use the backyard, but it better be clean when I get back tonight. Deal, and thank you. Weed's not technically a drug, right? I think there stands a valid argument. Right. Right? Right. <coughs> so what do you think? Can you help me find problem? My mom's kind of right, Zeke. Do you know how much work goes into planning these things? Yeah, of course. I mean, what do you think Pinterest is for? <laughs> Come on, I'm serious. Me too. I mean, Pinterest is revolutionary. But honestly, what do you think? Well, I think you're crazy, but I already mentioned that. If you're really serious about doing this, Zeke, you're going to need more than just me helping. Well, Zoe's coming over later, right? Yeah, she should be here soon. All right, Kirsten's also on his way. So we have, like, ten minutes. I'm going to go get some food. You stay here and think. Think. All right, I can do that. Maya's the cutest girl I've ever met. Thought number one complete. I know some of you are probably thinking something along the lines of, Oh crap, another cliche series with high schoolers. Huh, don't worry. This isn't Glee. Although I guess I should give you some more backstory. I'm gonna get my laptop. Grab mine too? Yeah. Maya and I met freshman year in our literature class. She went to a private school before Illwood, so I'd never seen her before. Anyway, we ended up talking after class, and we really liked each other. What are you thinking about? Just a first date. Aw, that was nice. Just us, sitting on the beach, talking for hours. God, I can't believe that was three years ago. No, it's crazy. Jeez, we're graduating like four months. <sighs> Damn. Hey guys, sorry we're late. My freaking car broke down. Yeah, she texted me so bad. This is Kirsten. He's my best friend. And Zoe is Maya's best friend. We've all been hanging out as a group since really Zoe moved here last year. Uh, yeah, what's going on? Rick put you in charge? Yeah, so I heard him talking over to Jason at lunch, and apparently they want to watch me fail at finding Palm. Why? Okay, so remember a couple years ago when I planned that super awesome graduation dance in eighth grade? Yeah, and? Well, Rick thought that he got too much attention for that, and I guess Rick wants to leave high school with a positive light on him. So, basically he's a douche. Agreed. I've only been here two years, but he definitely gives off a weird vibe, you know? See, you get me. She gets me. I do too. I just don't want you getting hurt. I won't, okay? Can we just do this? So here is what I have on prom stuff.
What are these? Just ideas. Oh yeah, so I did some research and apparently we gotta start with a theme. So. Any ideas? Maybe. A night in Paris. <laughs> oh yeah, and uh, Rick also sent me a list of rules by the ASB. So pretty much our prom has to cost less than $15,000, yada yada. And, okay here. So the theme has to be something that everyone in the class can relate to, that everyone can understand. That's actually a rule? God, what a pretentious jackass. Don't tell me about it, but I mean, I guess we're stuck with it, so... Night in Paris? Seems a little cliche. That's true. Let's see what else we have. Oh, what about something on a boat? Like a cruise across the San Francisco Bay? Oh yeah, my friend's school in Marin does that. Yeah, but we gotta stay under 15 grand here, and I feel like a boat might cost more than that. You're right. You need to clear your head, dude. You've been working on this for the past week. Relax a little. You think you're gonna beat me again, huh? <laughs> yeah, pretty much. I had a torn hamstring last time, right? Sure. <laughs> <laughs> Zeke, what do you say I play with Kirsten? I was like kicking your butt. Oh, it is so on. <laughs> Hell yeah, I'm in. Okay, here's the rules. Check the ball, gotta bring it past half if we have a turnover. Got it? I have no idea what you just said. But yeah, same. <laughs> Check. Check. Well, that was fun. Why don't we do that more often? So we don't give Zeke a heart attack? Ha ha ha, you're so funny. Alright, alright, I'll stop. So what do you think? Clear your head? Yeah, kinda. Let's get back to work. Agreed. Okay, um, what about Winter Wonderland? Oh, I like that. But it's not something that everyone can relate to. Damn. Hello? What's wrong? I don't. There was a girl named Goldie And a wolf who only thought there was one me and no one She broke the lock and entered He huffed and puffed and sent there Chinny chin chins Running for friends Cause when it's a trio You can defeat them One, two, three You and me and so L-O-V-E Together we could be the truth There is a bridge for crossing And always canes for walking For goats and mice Who come in thrice and if it's trolls or blindness that keep you from the finest one you could be, then think in three. 
Cause when it's a trio, you can defeat them One, two, three You and me and so L-O-V-E Together we could be the true story Of how all good things count in three